Yo, what's up? I am doing a shoot in New Jersey, and today I'm wearing the 9161. So the boots actually made it onto set, and I think that they will be featured in the ad. I saw some of the images, and they may be featured in there, but we have to stay tuned. But I'm glad that uh, they liked them, the boots, and I was able to wear them. Another, another Red Wing edition. Here we go. Hey, what's up everyone? So today um, we have another boot added to the collection and this one is pretty cool. It's quite special because this is the uh, 4328, which is the Red Wing Indigo Ferrera collab. And um, it's quite impressive. So this is what they, this is a nine inch boot. They have it labeled a nine, nine inch logger is what they're calling it on the box. And uh, I have to admit it, I already opened it, inspected it, and I'm very impressed. I know you guys probably saw how they, I really like how they teased it on Instagram and on the websites. They were releasing just little images here and there, a, a little a video and uh, just kind of showing just the hint of the boot. I thought that was really cool, kind of getting the hype surrounding um, this new release. And having it in hand, I'm very pleased. And I will definitely be wearing this a lot this uh, fall slash winter. And uh, probably even, oh, it's probably even, um, maybe even in the summer, you never know depending on how comfortable it is once I've broken it in. So, um, oh, today I'm wearing, sorry, I'm wearing the, let's put this down, the 875 Mock Toe. I'm kind of a little two days in a row wearing them. I, I, in, let me just let you know. So, I wore them yesterday and got two compliments about that oral leather. And I said, thought to myself, I was like, that's interesting that, I, I don't know what it is about the, that, maybe it's that leather, maybe because fall is here, people are looking and it kind of like reminds them of fall, but normally people in New York wear usually like something very dark, if you're wearing a boot, it's usually a dark brown or a black, maybe that's the reason, I'm not sure, but um, I got two compliments on that oral leather. You all know how that oral leather looks in person, it's just scrumptious. Okay. So, on to uh, the 4328. Let's uh, lace up this boot and take a closer look. It is uh, pretty impressive, so let's do it. Okay, so here's a closer look at the Red Wing Indigo Ferra collab, the 4328 Climber, and this is in the black prairie leather. And the one thing I really like about this, which is a nice touch, is that uh, green sole. That's just really cool. I like how it looks with this uh, black prairie because you know that as you wear the boot, the black, the brown will start to show underneath this um, this black overcoat. And the boot does come with two sets of laces. It comes with the leather pair, and then it comes with the taslin, which I don't really like the way the taslin look in there, so these will just go for something else or whatever be tossed aside with the other laces. Um, of course, we have the triple stitch on the climber. Yeah! Love it. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. We have seven eyelets, and then one, two, three, four for uh, machined speed hooks. These are cool. That's a really nice touch. And then uh, what else we have? We have the external heel counter there. Got a little pull tabby here. <laughs> this is a good looking boot indeed. And then you have that stack on that heel. Looking sharp. And I've seen a few images of the boot broken in and it looks really nice actually um, broken in. and. Um, I'm excited to wear these. The piping here, it looks like to me it matches the green. It has like a kind of greenish color to it now that I look at it under the light. I didn't really notice that at first. That's a nice touch by Red Wing or Indigo Ferro. I don't know the, who had the most say, but this uh, they did a good job on this. Now let's look at the inside of the other boot. You can see uh, who did the inspection here. If there's a ticket in there. Oh yeah. Anna, thank you Anna for inspecting the boot. And like I said, you get two laces with the boot and you see that brown 
leather there. And these boots were made May 2019, which brand spanking new, really. And unfortunately, the boot is canvas lined. It's not leather lined. If it were leather lined, it would be even better. But what can you do? And then you see that inside that sole, that leather sole there. Yeah, this is really nice. Uh, what was the other thing I wanted to mention about this? Oh, you also, in the box, which is really cool, you get 12 special limited edition cards. I'm going to lay these out and show them to you. Um, I like the card. Actually, I may frame one, uh, maybe one or two of them and uh, put them up somewhere. It was a nice touch, giving these with the uh, limited edition. And so these uh, 4328s are inspired by the uh, 919 Lyman boot released in 1977 and uh, like I had said before only 600 of these were released so I hope you were able to find yourself a pair I'm sure they're probably on eBay for some crazy amount maybe or uh, some other place but um, yeah these are uh, nice to add to the collection Alexa stop all right let's do the on feet so I will tell you that the fit, these boots aren't exactly that comfortable when you first put them on. I initially tried to put my right foot in and struggled and was not able to do it. So I moved on to my left foot, was able to get my left foot in. I was a little worried because I thought, okay, are these made, did I get the right size? Are these made on the eight last like I thought they were? And they are made on the eight last and I was able to get my left foot in first and then I just loosened the laces again on the boot and you really need that pull tab on there to get your foot in there and got it in <laughs> and um, it feels like if you already own an engineer or if you own a Pecos um, that's what the boot feels like on the um, left and right side of your arch and the back so after where your heel and your arch meet, you're gonna feel a lot of pressure there. So the boot really kind of like sucks in your foot there and you feel the pressure. So I wore these pretty much all day. Uh, this is the first time I put them on, wore them all day and I probably walked maybe um, two miles today, maybe three miles. And um, my feet weren't super happy, um, but I was just, I wanna break these in and um, that's, uh, they're not comfortable. <laughs> this is a simple way to put it. Eventually they will be, but like um, engineers, engineers are really uh, tough to break in. And at the end of the day, you want to remove them and throw them across the room. But that's just that, that soul and it's that just, you know, tough, tough soul. So here are the uh, cards that come with the uh, boot. And like I said, some of them, there are some of these images you've seen because they were kind of on the website and on the Instagram of Indigo Farah and Red Wing and other Red Wing um, shops in Europe, they posted these. Um, this one's pretty cool. This one I would probably, I could see like framing. I think that's a cool shot. The stuff with the guy I wouldn't frame, uh, just wouldn't. So this is the bandana that is available um, online uh, for this collaboration. Um, yeah, I don't know what to say about that. <laughs> Um, these watercolors I think are really cool. These can also be framed, which I think would be really neat to hang somewhere like an office or something. I think these are really neat. I'm not sure who the artist is who did those, but I, I really do like those. Those are cool. Or you can send them off. They're postcards. And you can send them to someone and they can do something with it. Don't know, but they are cool. I like them. And this is the inside of the um, box that they came in which is really cool this i think could be like a poster or like you know even a bandana that'd be kind of cool the 4328 is inspired by the 919 lineman boot which was released in 1977 a time period when eight inch boots were a common staple to the red wing collection the indigo fair crew are big fans of tall red wing styles such as the engineer logger and pecos so it was a natural decision deciding on the direction of the 9328, what they call the climber boot. 
One unique detail on the 4328 climber boot is the green Vibram sole originally used on the Regme Lyman boots back in 1956. Vibram continues to produce all red wing rubber soles used today. However, it is unclear as to why the green color was significant for the Lyman boots. One theory is that it was an indication that the sole was compounded with the electrical hazard installation between you and the ground. So if you happen to touch a live wire, you wouldn't get shocked. It gave wearers confidence that the shoes they were wearing were guaranteed to be safe while working up high lines. Those machine speed hooks are really nice. It's a really cool touch and just a little close up of the stitching on the uh, heel counter there. I think they did a really good job on this boot. And one of the things that I was really impressed with was this piping here. Having that, uh, these kind of things really mean a lot to me. Just having that hint of green piping on there to kind of go with the green sole. Uh, that's, those are the kind of things that I really like when you just kind of have these little, little small touches. So here's a close up of the uh, stacked heel with that um, green sole. It's just, it's really cool. I, I've seen these on uh, a logger from the 70s, the Green Hill. And I've also seen the Green Hill in the uh, Red Wing Bible and a couple of other um, Red Wing magazines out of Japan. And um, I, I like this. I, I, I would put this, this green sole on a couple of other boots that I've had just because it's something different and uh, kind of cool. Um, although that stacked heel currently is really tough. Um, but these the soles are strong and um, I, I know that uh, eventually the way I walk they'll start to angle off uh, on me and I'll have to send them for a resole but um, these boots are pretty special and they took their time designing them and I'm quite happy um, that I was able to get them only 600 pairs out there guys so hopefully you got your hands on them all right so that is the Red Wing Indigo Farrah collab the 4328 Climber in the black prairie leather. Thank you so much for watching and remember, be a boot. See you guys next time.